We'll get you out there. Military <laughs> members traveling through the airport will now have access to the USO Center all day long. This is really great. Yeah. It's now open 24 hours. Allie is downtown with all the details, and it's a beautiful center, Allie. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, it's absolutely gorgeous in here. And you know, this time of year that they really need, they got a ton of people who are coming through here and it's gonna continue to the first and the second. I have Ashley who's here this morning because a lot of people don't realize. So yes, during this time of year, you guys are open all the time. You're there to help those who are flying in and out, but you guys have so, you have a few different centers to help everybody this time of year. So we actually have four locations here in San Diego. We have our brand new Liberty station location which just opened it's about 4,000 square feet and it's surrounded by over 800 military housing units in the Point Loma area so we're able to serve people every single day in that center that center has our programs that are running for the people that are actually stationed here and live here so from the service members to the families um, we we execute our Tuesday night dinners out of our downtown center our mobile food pantry out of our downtown center we actually have a teen talk program we have a military spouse program um, and then we have a lot of events we do entertaining of the troops we do comedy shows we do celebrity appearances um, we try to create resilient programming so that the people that are stationed here feel like they're gonna have a good time through their their time in San Diego um, in our airport location we're serving thousands of people this month as they travel in and out um, so they're going on leave they're coming back from leave they're going to schools here um, but there are four locations that are doing that. So airport, Liberty Station, downtown, and sometimes people don't realize that we're actually in the military entrance processing station as well. Wow, because you just everywhere and obviously, you know, a lot of people want to get involved with you as well. I'm sure you guys get that all the time. Like, oh, I want to come volunteer and help because it takes the volunteers to run this center. 24 7 it takes everybody coming together in order to do that so we could not do it without our volunteers we have 12 staff members between the four locations and so we have over 400 volunteers that volunteer consistently on an annual basis um, so that's over 52,000 hours of volunteer service because we have those four locations this location here at the airport is open from 6 a.m. to midnight so that's four different shifts of volunteers that are serving and helping us meet our mission every day. Oh, it's a busy, busy place this time of year, you guys. And uh, we're going to have more coming up from here in just a little bit. Good morning, San Diego. We'll be right back.